Okay, so now the way that we can add these custom objects is where uh, the, I have uh, uh, programmed these two buttons for uh, adding uh, the mar marking the areas which is under the rectangle for observation. So if I now click add, this will be marked uh, and denoted by, by an auto numbered ID and uh, its corresponding state is also observed by the program which will keep on observing. Now if I want to move the rectangle and uh, mark other objects for the observation, I can just keep scrolling to the right by the clicking of this button. Uh, there was a hitch over here uh, that uh, if I connect the USB keyboard to the Raspberry Pi 2, the, there is a problem with the re uh, repeat of the keys. So the cursor just starts going wildly which is why I am not uh, showcasing this pro code with a keyboard but ideally this code is uh, if you see it in the desktop app is programmable via the keyboard input as well. So this is how you zoom up and zoom down the rectangle which defines the area of the code or the observation which I want to do. I will now mark this second rectangle as observed. So it has uh, the second rectangle has been uh, selected as 3 and the first has, uh, has been marked as 2. Now if I scroll, switch on this uh, rectangle, it, uh, the third one should uh, be activated as on and which is on. 